little anxious because I don't know what to expect and I'm a planner and I like to be prepared. And she I... spent years working as an emergency doctor. I know why everything's different right now, post COVID, right? But what awaits Dr. Camilla Sasson in New York is something she's never seen up close. Now it's like, it feels like the quiet before this like crazy storm and you're in the eye of the hurricane and you're looking at this like these like gale force winds swirling at you and you have no idea when it's going to be done. She anticipates being there for at least a month treating patients with COVID-19. Sasson will help at three hospitals in the Queens and Brooklyn areas, as well as a separate field hospital. And every single day, it's that same threat and that same uncertainty of not knowing what your day is going to look like. What should I bring with me? Um, candy. Something she can't take with her. My son actually tonight broke my heart and said, you know, um, Mom, I don't want you to leave. I'm going to miss you. I don't want you to get sick. Those she loves. It's hard as a mom to, to leave your kids, but um, I know that I have like the best husband ever um, and he's going to take care of them and and he's going to um, he's going to be rooting for me. And so will the rest of Colorado, howling for heroes like Dr. Sasson on the front line. Working in the emergency department's a team sport, right? And I feel like my team is out in New York City right now. I don't even know them yet, <laughs> but I know that they need help. And so um, I'm going to go. Jordan Chavez, 9 News. Dr. Sasson says one big reason she's going to New York is to show her kids it is okay to be brave and afraid, to show them that helping others sometimes comes with sacrifices.